vacation every single day because I love my occupation. Hey, I'm on vacation. If you don't like your life, then you should go and change it. Hey, I'm on vacation every single day because I love my occupation. Hey, I'm on vacation. Hello, 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 everyone. It is me, Tony Ward. It is I. <laughs> it is I, Tony Ward, with Evolution Travel. I am here to train you this evening on, or this morning, or this afternoon, or whenever it is that you're watching this fabulous Zoominar um, video. <clears throat> I'm here to give you some information and train you on how to make money in your first 30 days here at Evolution Travel. Okay, so grab a pen, grab a piece of paper, get your smartphone, whatever you need to do to take some notes, because this information that I'm gonna share with you today is going to help you with your business in your first 30 days. So what I wanna to talk to you about first, you guys, um, and I wanna say just off the bat, if you just got started today, congratulations. If you've been in the business for, you know, a couple months congratulations um if you've been in the business for a year or two and you want to just kind of refresh and start over from today congratulations you've taken that first step to self-sufficient financial freedom okay um and i want to tell you that you are the key to your success and that's super important because the mindset that you need to have your own business is the most important part of business is your mindset. I know none of you got started in this business to be someone's employee, right? We want to now be the boss. We want to own our own. And that's why we started our own home-based business. And you have to first develop that mindset to understand that you are 100% key to your success okay now we have all types of you know technology at our fingertips these days we have our smartphones we have our ipads we have our tablets we have our laptops you name it we have it um so many different devices that we keep with us on a regular basis that actually think for us so let's use them let's start thinking for ourselves and use that technology to help us get where we want to go okay first thing first super important you want to definitely calendarize every single thing you need to do in the next 30 days. We want to sit down and have a nice, um, direct, um, handwritten or um, in your phone or whatever. We want a nice blueprint of what our next 30 days is going to look like so that we can really achieve the goals that we're working for or towards um, for this end of this 30 days. If you just got started today and your goal at the end of this 30 days is to be um, a professional travel agent and you have booked a couple you know, trips, you have a couple trips under your belt, you're trying or you're trying to go on your own trip or whatever if that's your goal let's put it on paper and let's figure out exactly how to get to that goal if you just got started today and you want to be you know one of the positions in our company whether it be an executive or bronze or silver or gold whatever it is you want to get to in your first 30 days write that down and let's go along with the steps um, that you need to achieve those goals okay they, it is so possible to make money in your first 30 days while you are achieving those two goals that we just mentioned a second ago so the trainings are important calendarize them get those trainings um, they're in your back office your sponsor has them um, they're on Facebook they're also on a website that we put together for you called welcome to evolution.com if you go to welcome to evolution.com you will find the webinars and the trainings there for you all of the flyers are there for you so make sure you put all of those in your phone so that you can get a reminder a couple hours before or a day before a couple minutes before however you have it signed up but you will definitely stay in the loop because staying in the loop is how you end up in the pool okay that's the residual pool i'm talking about staying in the loop is how you find out about all the perks that the company has going on in the travel industry even outside of evolution just in the travel industry itself staying in the loop is how you find out about all the extras that you can do to work your business so that you can make money in your first 30 days okay you guys now 
you have to understand number one that this is a well-oiled machine a well-oiled machine and as long as you know what the parts are as long as you know how they work together as long as you know how to you know operate it you are on a roll you're on a on the go you're going to get where you're going right you need to number one follow the system that's in place for you you know they always say when you're going to you know culinary school and you're trying to make a dish for the very first time you cannot change the recipe if you have not successfully made the meal that of course is my saying but if you have not successfully completed that meal you cannot change the recipe so we want you to go ahead and complete the meal get to your goal and then you can tweak it after that but you need to follow the system follow the recipe follow the proven um, system that's out there that's been working for everyone who has made it and you want to stay positive I'm here to tell you that this is one of the biggest roller coaster rides you are going to ride on. It's going to be very beneficial, okay? It's going to be um, extremely fun. When you get to the end of the ride, you're going to be like, oh my goodness. There were times when I was afraid. There were times when I was happy. There were times when I was scared. There were times when I was like, oh my God, why did I even get on this ride? But now that I'm at the finish line, I want to ride it again. So stay positive, okay, and stay focused. Focus is the biggest part of that. Part of the engine is your focus because once you lose sight, okay, once you lose focus, once you lose sight, your destination becomes a little blurry your goals seem a little bit more farther away okay um things seem a little bit harder your lows get a little bit lower that no can knock you off the rails so we have to stay focused because staying focused staying positive will allow you to continue to follow the system but they all go together they all go hand in hand now you have to understand a few things you guys and the stuff i'm going to tell you um is super simple super simple but sometimes the most simplistic things can seem the hardest to digest and understand so what i need you to understand number one is this is my business say that to yourself this is my business this is my business this is my business guess what it was your thirty dollars that got you started it's your monthly fee that's going to keep you going this is your business and guess what it'll be your name on that check when you get paid because this is your business and the work that you put into this business is directly correlated to what you get out of it you are responsible for your own success period say that to yourself i am responsible for my own success i am responsible for my own success not the person who brought you into the business they're not responsible thank you thank you thank you to them for offering you an opportunity such as great as this period but they're not responsible for your success they're not your mom they're not your dad they're not that teacher in the sixth grade they're not your boss they're the person who shows you this opportunity and now it's completely 100 percent up to you to become successful because i promise you this everything they know you have access to everything that makes them successful is also available to you it's in your back office it's on the internet it's there but it's up to you to go and search it out you can't say that business didn't work for me because my sponsor never called me back that has nothing to do with your success they're not your boss they're not your mom they're not your dad they're not responsible for your success you're responsible for your success you can't say well i'm not successful because there's nobody in my area that's in the company. I'm just here by myself. That's not a good excuse. We have Zoom, Zoominars every single day. We have training that's you know recorded for you every single day. 
you have to first, number one, take ownership. When you start this business on day one, you have to sit down and take ownership and say, this is my business. I am responsible for my success. Go on with those affirmations and tell yourself, I am not an employee because you're not. You don't work for Evolution Travel. You work for you. You work for your check, which is super fabulous because guess what, you guys? You have the awesome opportunity to make as much money as you feel you're worth because you're going to put in as much time as you feel is worthy. It just makes sense. You are no longer an employee. You are now the employer of your life. You are the boss, period. You do not have a boss. You are the boss. Tell yourself, I am the boss. And let me explain something to you. You are the boss of you. <laughs> okay? That's a big one. That's a big one. Because everybody gets into this company, they become the boss, right? You're the boss of your website. You're the boss of your business. You're the boss of your specific you know um situation in evolution travel you are not the boss of your downline you are not the boss of the people that you bring in is their money to become a home-based business owner guess what is an owner which means in their right they are a boss so this is one thing i see people do wrong all the time yeah, I signed up this lady. She got in the business, but she won't do what I say. She won't answer my calls. She won't listen to me. I told her to do X, Y, and Z, and I told her to get on the call, and I told her, let me bring you back to life. Let me reel you back in, sweetie. You are there for support. You are there for help. You are there for guidance. You are not there to be the boss, okay? because they pay their money and they are the boss of their business. You are the boss of your business and you can run your business how you see fit. You don't have any quotas, you don't have any timelines, you are the boss. Now you can seek out mentorship from other bosses if that's what you want to do. But in your mind, you must understand that you're the boss. Now, leaders, you guys, I'm not saying don't listen to anybody. That's, that's the furthest from what I'm saying. What I'm saying is leaders are learners, number one. And we can all learn from each other, period. But having that management mentality will not take you far in a business where everybody is management in their own home-based business, right? We're the boss. Okay, so my success is directly related to my efforts and no one else's, period. Your efforts will definitely equate to your bank account. Whether or not you call back your clients with a quote, uh, whether or not you take their you know, quotes seriously and do them in a, a timely fashion, um, whether or not you, you know, even your new people, if you sign somebody up for the business, but you don't tell them about welcome to evolution.com, you can tell a new person about welcome to evolution.com and go on vacation for a month and they're fine because they have every single thing they need under their fingertips. They know who to talk to, they know where to go, they know what to look up, they know how to find it. There's even a seven, my first seven days in evolution. If they follow the process, they'll be fine. But you have to at least show them that direction to go to, and then it's okay. So your daily tasks, you need to write these down. Your daily tasks are important. And there's just four that will help you stay on track, especially in your first 30 days. If you do this every single day for your first 30 days, I promise you this is a habit that will form and you'll do this for the rest of your life in evolution, okay? So you wanna open up your back office. A lot of times people won't even open their back office. They'll call you 15 days in, 21 days in. When the bill comes in 30 days, and they'll say, um, what's my password? I can't find my password. I don't know what my password is. Can you help me with my password? 
And it's like, oh my goodness, <laughs> you know? But, you know, you, you wanna look at them like they've done something wrong, but you need to kinda uh, get that mirror and look back at yourself. And I'm gonna tell you why. Because when you first get someone in the business, in the first 30 days, the first thing you should do with them is help them log into their back office. Immediately, they should log into their back office because you need to show them where that PTA training situation is at, the only yellow thing in the back office, you need to show them that, period. So that just makes sense. Um, check your emails. Okay, and first, before I go to check your emails, Open your back office and actually look at what's going on back there. Did you know that in your back office, a lot of times people say, well, I don't know what happened to my upline. I don't know what happened to a sponsor. You know, they get to the blame game. The blame game starts happening. I didn't know what to do. But in your back office, everything and anything you could possibly want is there, including contact information for your sponsor, for your sponsor, sponsor, for your sponsor, sponsor, sponsor. That's all in your back office. Super simple. Just click on my upline and it's gonna show you exactly phone number, email, name, everything. So there's no reason why you won't be connected to who you need to be connected so that they can show you exactly where you need to go. Okay, so explore your back office. Don't just open it. This should also say explore it. Explore your back office. Now check your emails. Make sure you are checking your emails every single day. Corporate sends very important emails and you need to not only check them, open them, read them, follow the directions, okay? I know we had a situation where our pay was changed. Our pay process was changed. And actually it was an upgrade. It was a beautiful change. I'm super excited about that change. Woo -woo! To management, to corporate. But <clears throat> there were people who complained. I didn't know about that. No one said that. What's going on? How come I didn't get paid today? I don't understand. Did you read your email? Oh, well, I haven't opened my email yet. I didn't know that they sent an email. Well, nobody told. Okay. The blame game, you guys, stops here. This is a business. And email is one of the prime ways that they communicate in the business that we're in because there's so many of us. They can't make a phone call to everybody. There's thousands of us. Check your email every day, okay? Important information comes through the email almost once a week, sometimes twice, three times a week. Open your email. If your email is not attached to your, you know, your personal assistant, that phone that we we're talking about, Attach it to your phone so that it pops up, so that you see it immediately. So you see when it says urgent um, money matters, open now, read until the end, evolution travel, whatever. Make sure you are reading those emails every single day. Also, what you get in emails, let me tell you, good stuff, okay? When uh, Jamaica invited me to come out for five days for $25, they didn't call me. They sent me an email. Now, if I would have not opened that email and it would have passed the date when I could respond or whatever, I wouldn't have been able to participate in that, you know, offer. So you are going to get a lot of things in your email, especially when you start your training, especially when you're doing all those, you know, extra specialist trainings. They're going to be inviting you out to come and visit the resorts. They're going to be inviting you out, sending you fam trip invitations. You have to check your email every single day. Check your email. Now, number three, write down your goals for the day. Super important, write them down. It's one thing to think about them and say them to yourself. It's something totally different to write that information down so that you have that in your head. Um, and it's not just you know in your head because other things happen during the day and we, it kind of gets pushed to the back. You wake up in the morning, you say, okay, I'm gonna go post about um, booking a trip. I see who I can get who wants to book a trip. Oh yeah, I need to also do that quote for the other lady. Okay, and then after you do this, and then what happens? You make breakfast, you take the kids to school, you go to work, um, it's traffic, you got all kind of other things that pop up and that has to happen. And then those those goals that you had for the day kind of go to the wayside, not because you're just, you know, they, they're not priority, 
but because you just basically forgot we're human, right? But if you write them down and you put them on a stick them and put them on your dashboard or, you know, put it on your the outside of your wallet or somewhere where you're going to see it, something that you frequent, then more than likely you'll get those things done. It's super um, important to get that stuff done, okay? So make sure you write them down. And the most important part is make sure you act on your goals. You got to follow the steps to achieve whatever goal you want to achieve. You can't say, I want to be a silver consultant, and then you tell nobody about your business. You can't say that you want to book a cruise, a group cruise, because you want to get some group cruise you know, money, and you tell nobody about your business. You can't say, I want to make some money in my first 30 days, and you never open your back office. They don't go hand in hand. I can't say I want to lose 100 pounds and never go to the gym. While I'm talking about it, I'm eating donuts and cake and cookies and ice cream. You can't do the opposite of what's going to get you to your goal. You actually have to get where you need to go by following the steps that are going to get you there. Now, I want you guys to know um, one thing. And this Steve Jobs said this. And he said, great things in business are never done by one person. They're done by a team of people. You need to understand that achieving your goals will take a team of people, okay? It's gonna take for, like say your goal is to book a group trip. That's gonna take a team. It's gonna take the people at Royal Caribbean. It's gonna take you. It's gonna take the people that are gonna sign up for that group. It's gonna take a group of people to achieve that goal. No matter what your goal is, great things in business are never done by one person. They're done by a team of people, okay? Let's see here. Now, this right here, I love this slide, and I'm going to tell you why. Because this kind of encompasses every single thing that is travel and home-based travel. I mean, if you look at the passports, everybody here, if you don't have your passport yet, please get your passport. Super simple system. You can't honestly say you are a travel agent, but you don't have a passport. What if you do the training for Fiji and you get an email because you're checking your emails every day and you get an email that says, hey, we see that you're now a specialist of Fiji. We'd like for you to come out and explore our islands. We will send you your ticket information and your free stay in your email by Friday. And you don't have a passport. You've missed an awesome opportunity to experience something that's going to um, enhance your business. Get your passport. Don't be one of those people who don't have your passport and I'm gonna get it or no, that should be priority one. Get your passport, okay? Now, you see a picture of a lady on the beach having a good time, right? This should be your focus, if not for you, for your clients, for your kids. The smile on her face speaks volumes, period. This is what we do. This is what we embody. Not her specifically, because you might be a man, you might be taller, you might be shorter, you might be, you know, bigger, small, whatever, different skin color, it doesn't matter. Her smile encompasses freedom it encompasses financial freedom it in, you know it, it shows it displays uh time freedom she's having a good time you know and that's what we do with evolution travel we have a good time in your first 30 days find your freedom find your happiness you can see her happiness through this picture make sure you are happy doing what you love Find something that you can do that you love because clients will gravitate to that. Clients are not going to gravitate to something that's not positive because why would I want more negativity in my life? I'd rather have a little bit of sugar to take away some of the, you know, sour, right? This camera right here, you are going to become a product of your product and posting pictures, posting, you know, uh, travel situations, you know, showing the world how you live your life is a huge way to market your business. Even if it's just a picture of you sitting in your bed with your laptop working, 
That's a fabulous way to commute to work. All you have to do is get your laptop off the nightstand. That's fabulous. Use your camera to market your business in anything you do and be creative about it. This is a postcard. I am so happy that I became a travel agent. I am experiencing the world. You could join me. Let's talk when I get back. This is the postcard. This is a great idea. If you're going somewhere, um, grab some postcards and send it to your friends and family. You know, even if you're not, let's see, you have people living in Vegas, people living in San Francisco, people living in Hawaii, everywhere. Send a postcard from your city to somebody. It would be fabulous because people rarely get mail. Do that in your first 30 days. That's a great, um, just an eye opener. That's a great introduction to your business. You can even get postcards from the cruise companies, Carnival, Royal Caribbean, Princess, all of them have postcards that you can actually get for free. I'll repeat that, for free, that you can use and actually mail to prospective customers. Super cool idea. Everybody's on social media. A lot of people don't mail stuff anymore. Do something out of the ordinary to open, you know, to kind of get them thinking like, oh, wow. So use that. Be, be a product of your product and make sure that they understand that, you know, I just started this business, my first 30 days. This is what I have to offer. Let me show you. Get those postcards out there, okay? Get that information out there. Now, Let's get down to business. Your mindset is ready. You understand that you are the key to your business. I don't want you sitting around for 30 days waiting for somebody to hold your hand and guide you through the process. I want you to take ownership of your success, of your freedom, of your business, and I want you to know what you can do yourself to get where you wanna go, okay? So there's four things that I'm gonna focus on right now to show you how to get money right away. And one of those things, super cool, Advantage Direct, I love, love, love it. You have immediate access to Advantage Direct as soon as you get started in this business. It is, the information is located in your back office. If you go to welcometoevolution.com and you download the welcome pack, the login information is located on there too. So I've given you two different places where this information is located so you can get all of it. Advantage Direct. You can resell condos. These condos are located in over 105 different countries, and there are over 5,000 of them. You can resell them immediately and make immediate monies. Your commission comes directly to you with Advantage Direct, immediate. You can be making money the day after you get started. So make sure you go in and you explore Advantage Direct and you use what you have to make some money right away. Now the discount directory, you guys remember the little entertainment books that they used to sell, you know, for fundraisers at schools and stuff. Well, that's what discount directory is. It is the virtual electronic version of that. Now before you had to choose what city you wanted, which county you wanted or whatever, you would buy that particular book. But Evolution Travel gives you the directory for the entire United States. So I don't care if you're in New York or Colorado, you can put in the zip code where you are and the, dis the discounts, the coupons will pop up for that particular place. I'm gonna tell you guys a funny story about a guy who joined the business, works you know, in corporate office, they do the lunch you know, every single day. And so he looked in his discount, discount directory and saw that they had a Subway coupon in there. Buy one, get one free. So he had an idea, wanted to see if it was going to work. You know, the company was ordering Subway that day. So he was like, I'll go pick up the sandwiches. You know, everybody gave him their money for the Subway sandwiches. He went to pay for them, used his coupon, and he got half off of the entire order. So he was like, I'm picking up sandwiches every day, and I'm going to use my coupons, $40 off the top, just because he went and picked up the lunch. You know, so he definitely started making money his first um uh, shoot, his first week of the business, he was already paying for his business for the month. So there's certainly different coupons in there that you can use for yourself to save money. Saving money is equivalent to making money because if you didn't have to spend it, guess what? You get to keep it. 
So this is definitely a way to save money by keeping money. If you're using the coupons for yourself, and if you're smart like this guy, then you're able to actually make some money. You know, that's his delivery fee, whatever he wants to call it. But he was smart enough to get started in a company that afforded him coupons that to do and to live like he was living anyway, but now he gets to benefit from it monetarily. So kudos to him, super smart. The next thing that you can do, you guys, is level up. Now, a lot of times people get in this business and they say, you know what, I'm not really into the multi-level marketing part. I just want to book travel. That's all I want to do. Well, guess what, you guys? That's exactly what I said, too. Super, 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 the same exact thing. And that's okay because, you know, um, the marketing part is definitely optional. You do not have to do it at all. You can forget that point three is even here. I'll just talk about point three for those of you who are interested in this part of it. What happened with me was I fell in love with the benefits. I fell in love with the fact that I got these free cruises and invitations to Jamaica and all the stuff. And I said, you know what? My mom deserves the same things I deserve. My sisters deserve to have some freedom. I hate seeing that they have to work so hard and they can't go on vacation and they got to save for two years to go away for one week. That's crazy to have to save for two years to go away for one week, right? I'm like, I want them to be able to have the same freedom as me. I want them to see their kids grow up. I'm going to share this with them because it would be selfish of me not to share it with them. So I started sharing because I cared about them, period, point blank, end of discussion. And because of that, I leveled up. Now, if you level up to a bronze position, that means you cared enough about six people to share it, bottom line, period. And that position pays over $100 a month right? So that definitely takes away that $69.95 um, business, business maintenance fee. I'm sorry, I'm getting tongue-tied. Business maintenance fee. That takes over that whole portion of it for you. So that's definitely a way to level up um, is for just the six people. Now, some people charge or research or booking fee when they book their um, airfare, trips, and groups. They'll charge a, a research fee. Because a lot of times, and you will, this will happen, and I don't want you to be discouraged, but this will happen. Um, you'll get people that ask you about trips and stuff all the time, and then they won't either respond to your quote or they'll decide to go with somebody else. Don't be upset by it. Use that as a learning tool, as a, a practice exercise. Because if you were in school, you know, before the test comes, right, before that final exam comes, you have learning exercises and quizzes and you know different um, things you have to do so use that as a learning exercise so that when you get that big group of people who are really going to pay you're ready you know what to do you've done it before thank that person for giving you um the practice that's just your practice homework because that main event will happen and guess what you're going to be ready so thank them for that so this is just a brief overview of what you can do um, with your company in the first 30 days. There are so many different ways to make money in your first 30 days, it's crazy. I'm gonna tell you the main way to make some money is to get started. If you haven't gotten started yet and you're listening to this Zoominar um, and you want to get started, that first $30 is like money in the bank. And I'm gonna tell you, that by itself qualifies you for tax deductions, the, your monthly fee of $69.95, it's like putting money in the bank, money in the bank, money in the bank, money in the bank. So just getting started in itself helps you to start, you know, saving money um, and making money because not only do you get to write that off as an agent, you get to write off tons of other stuff. So definitely that's making you money and the most, the smartest thing uh, you can ever possibly do um, is to start your own home-based business, you know, and you, you never want to start a business just to make money. You want to start a business to make a difference because once you start to make that difference, the money will follow automatically, period, because the person who solves the most problems ends up making the most money. And that's definitely it, what it is, you know? Um, one thing I always hear is doubt kills more dreams than failure ever will. The only way you can fail in this business is if you quit. 
you're not gonna fail. You know, might you might not get to a hundred thousand dollars in sales the first year. You might not get to that platinum position that you're looking for, you know, within your, your first year or whatever. But as long as you don't quit, the possibilities are still there. As soon as you quit, your possibilities have all been taken away. So, you know, doubt kills more dreams than failure ever will. And the only way you can fail in this business is if you quit. And you're not quitting on the person that brought you into this business because they're going to get paid regardless. You're quitting on yourself. So take this information. Use it wisely. Remember, go to welcometoevolution.com. Use everything that's on there. It's open for you. Use it. Um at your, whatever you want to do with it, just use it. It's updated all the time for you to make sure you have, you know, up-to-date information. Use it. Download your welcome pack. Download your first seven days in evolution travel. Make sure you're looking at everything because it's there for you. And remember, you are 100% responsible for your, your success, period. This is Tony Ward travel agent training specialist with Evolution Travel and One Star Platinum for now, but that will change. Wishing you all the best in the world and in your business. And I'll see you at the beach and at the bank. I'm signing off. This Zoominar is officially over. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye, you guys. <laughs>